back Instagram. Welcome into the channel. All right, this is Sage, Sunset Healing Tarot. About to get some messages for you. Thank you for being in here. Uh, hope to get some good messages. Okay, I see good messages about changes. Of course, we know a lot is going on. Um, and maybe someone watching you literally in your home. Thank you so much for liking the video, for subscribing to the channel, and for sharing the messages with those you love. All right, so now let us get into this one. I feel like there's a situation that had you crying or upset or just really worried. Maybe someone was watching you, micromanaging you. Um, this emperor... You know, he's a boss, the head of a company, the owner of a company, Vir um, I mean, Earth Energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, very grounded, very um, con 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 connected to earthly things, um, working, always working, making money. This has something to do with your home, okay? But I do feel like a home or a marriage for some people or a business union okay or something having to do with the family families coming together so maybe your your um in-laws perhaps something like that a disturbance having to do i mean maybe someone in your your in-laws family suddenly have a change of heart about a situation and it's causing some disturbances but it's breaking your heart i feel like cancer is making you a bit sad but the thing is, I feel like you just feel somewhat disconnected from your faith right now. You know what I mean? It's as if you're not taking action because you're not sure what to do. And it, that makes you feel worse, kind of worse stuck. But the thing is, your spirit is working. It's like you're not taking action. It's as if you have a partner working with you. And they have gone, they've told you to hold on a minute. And they've gone to do some work, you know, to break into the building to figure out what's going on so that they can come back to you. But you've been waiting. You haven't had, um, you haven't gotten really any messages. Or maybe you are just feeling out of tune with that energy. So you're not sure what to do, what action to take. Are you to continue waiting? Why is this happening? But, you know, there's a change coming. I feel like you're about to make the decision on your own, okay? Instead of waiting, you're about to make a decision. And it feels urgent. Mm -hmm. Like you're saying, maybe this person needs help. So maybe you're going to start strengthening your spirit and your faith and your intuition. Okay? So you're going to help your spirit out so that you can realign because you're not helpless. You shouldn't just sit here in the dark crying like that. You know, um, there's something about listening to your surroundings as well to help you break up the consistent thought patterns that play around in your mind. So there's something about like even the crickets like this one coming through something about listening to this subtler sounds with the tool of swords with the intuition the moon vibration you know allow those feelings to get into your senses your vibration it will help to calm you and help to oh my god i feel like that is how you can listen to your spirit literally so i feel the the in the animals around you and so on and so forth maybe they that's how you can listen to your spirit coming through with messages for you on what to do, what decisions to make, you know, look for omens and so on and so forth. Like this is will help to um, fortify your faith, give you strength to move forward. There's also some love coming into you, you know, like you've been sad, someone's going to come around and offer some love like that. Maybe this, is, this person is new, a new person coming through, or old soulmate returning. But this person is definitely 
your soulmate vibration not necessarily romantically this person is water sign fellow water sign cancer pisces scorpio okay or it's just a feeling that you're going to get it's like hush little baby don't you cry everything is going to be okay it's almost like getting the spiritual comfort that you needed you know like be you know realizing you're not alone someone is there with you while let me show you this even if you cry as you cry see so it's almost like you being vulnerable or this is when you're going to be open to receiving because your spirit is coming back to you now i feel like it's beautiful my vibration is changing now it's as if this light is coming in your direction yes 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 it's as if you were crying and then all of a sudden this light like a visit from your loved one a spirit or just a feeling and it it um, makes you hold your head up and embrace it it's like a good feeling like everything is possible i feel you i receive you yeah that's nice that's nice okay the ten of pentacles is here i want to mention it feels like dreams coming true like something you've always wanted ted it has something to do with value something to do with values money well-being worth but it's amplifying your feelings of well-being prosperity success joy and abundance and balance it feels like balance mm -hmm. financially oh you know why it feels like balance because this feeling has been accomplished in you that level of worthiness and value you know i feel like you're walking down the street feeling good beautiful you're attracting others attention right now you could be interested in meeting vibration or have starting a family or relocating with your family just starting over moving to a new city or you know changing cultures or something like that not changing cultures but moving to somewhere where there, it's a different culture but you know probably adopting a different culture as well that's possible mm -hmm. someone may may have a son a beautiful little baby boy with fat little cheeks someone you have may have dogs here or you love animals particularly dogs there's something about this particular pentacle what is that? It's almost like someone won. Won something. It is attached to you, this pentacle. Let me see if I can get it. It's like the energy of the three of pentacles. The sun. Yeah, this is what it is. in your heart your soul so you walk awakened and you know you've made changes having to do with your home your life your entire well-being for you and are you don't know that and i'm telling you okay so you know you're also at this nine with the crying you know the nine of swords so you're almost you're gonna get to the ten, and then after that, that's when the breakthrough comes. That's when we. That's why we saw the ten of pentacles as well as the ten of hearts. So you get, you move through the cycles. You know it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay because we have a justice vibration. <clears throat> I'm feeling like you have clairvoyant capabilities, my dear Cancer. By the way, at this point, if the messages are resonating with you, do hit the like button and consider sharing the messages with those you love. <laughs> All right, so something is brought into balance because you uncovered a truth, a secret. Maybe something within you it could very well be. 
And uh, so that's why you're going to get justice. Maybe you've been meditating. Something, it's as if um, you've, I don't want to say you've been cheated, but kind of like that. It's as if you've been playing a game where you didn't, you weren't informed of the rules, so it was unfair. Um, so I feel like you should maybe learn more about some, some work. Maybe about the law as it relates to any situation that you're dealing with. And also use your intuition. That's where the balance comes in. You're going to balance physical and spiritual. So spiritual is your intuition. Your ancestors is what you knew, what you know growing up, who you are, what you represent. You know? I feel something will fall. The screen of wands. It's the energy of this one being found out by justice that this was the culprit, something like that. The Queen of Wands, maybe possessive, a sexually open, masculine, feminine person, a temptress. One, yeah, fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but not necessarily. You know, this person, they think they have a lot of tricks up their sleeves. You know, like, they, they think their game is slick, <laughs> slicker than everyone else's, especially in the mental. They know how they're manipulative. Mm -hmm. So they tell you what you want to hear. They'll flirt. So I do feel like this person may be exposed for the truth. Maybe this person has like brunette hair or something. Brown colored. There will be a celebration of the ending of this. Championing through for you. But it's almost as if you, you're not fully celebrating. Because there's something more that you need to do. I feel like there's someone <clears throat> moving toward you into your space. I feel like they're very close. Like this person is opening your gates and you're seeing this. I feel like you know who I'm talking about. It's the person that came to your mind. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, possibly a person you left in your past. Someone that's expecting to hear from you or you're expecting to hear from maybe this is another person fire sign that some kind of anxious or beaten up or bothered about a situation having to do with money or finances or like feeling like they've been losing money mm -hmm. they plan on ending some cycle or making a tough decision to clear something out but I don't like the intention behind it. You know what I mean? This person, maybe this fire sign or this earth sign that's moving toward you. Or even a water sign. I don't know. So many people. But I... Mm, anywho. There's the devil card here just to let you know. I feel like the other thing you're focused on why you're not celebrating right now is completely exposing this devilish vibration. I feel like you're going to be spending money on it. Maybe you're going to get therapy with the Empress vibration. It's going to help you to sharpen your focus and to also let your guard down, open your heart space, release past trauma so you can be free. Yes. <laughs> I literally feel like me. <laughs> I feel free. Yeah. It's like releasing everything and being free. I feel like a little bird just opening the cages and flying out. Like free. Um, but there's I don't know why you're frowning. Maybe you should smile more, I don't know, cancer. But you look comfortable. You look like you have everything around you that will make you feel good. There's something about a Pisces child or you're a Pisces child. I don't know. There's something about children around you, like they're your angels, or maybe this is Cupid, but there's one presence specifically above your head, possibly right. Okay, I don't want to do that. But it feels present. Like it's always over you, like this childlike energy. 
maybe they're i don't know what are these things let's ask let's see if i can ask because i don't know much about these things this is child like energy the jack of hearts say something i want to say I want, I long, I hope. It is my wish to achieve you. I don't know. So why are they appearing in this child-like vibration? With fish vibration. Fish tail. Maybe this person is a fellow water sign. Maybe this person is Pisces. Let's see. What else? So why are they hanging around? Like they're guiding you, watching you, protecting you. You're studying this. This is like this feels like me doing this tarot right now. Look at her, like trying to figure this out. What's going on? Okay, so she wants to know. All right, I want to know what this thing is. This childlike thing. It is kind of deep, you know. Mm -hmm. The answer is, oh Jesus! It just feels like this. I don't know. Dreams, dream again. No new what desires, new destination. Making a decision to move towards someone by just desires and feelings, being led by your emotions. Is that evident? Someone is giving you some attention. Maybe being flirtatious. Ace of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What else? The truth. Maybe someone in your family that wants to make you happy or wants to have a family with you. Okay. And they're sorry. Okay. So. All right, that is that. These are your Sunday messages. I hope you found some that inspires you and is able to help you along your journey to inflame vibration. It's as if you're just not sure if you're to celebrate this. You're figuring something else out. You know, but you're almost ready. All right. All right, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being here. See you in the next one. All right. Hit the like button on your way out. Share the messages and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next time. Bye. Remember that you are all and all is within you.